Hello everyone, this is Defense Politics Asia. So this is a Donetsk front. At the Donetsk front, uh, there is fighting reported across the entire front line. We are fighting reported at Staromayovsky, uh, Novodonetsk, uh, Novo Novodonetsk, uh, south of Zolotaneva, uh, Voleda, uh, Novo Mihailivka, north of Novo, Novo Mihailivka, Boyeda, Ukrainian counterattack at no Boyeda. Uh, Georgivka and Krasnohorivka. Uh, of note, uh, the one at uh, Voleda as well as Staromayovsky and I think Novodonetsky. These are all fire missions. These are, these are not active assault. And uh, and uh, so this and then uh, north of Zolotaneva there was a Lancet strike being uh, recorded uh, to have attacked a Ukrainian tank uh, north of Zolotaneva. So not very important in that sense. So uh, so. These are just fire missions, so you know nothing to really worry about. Over at this uh, Marinka sector, uh, the Russian forces have taken the southern part, which shows that uh, there is still active assault with a uh, showing of the flag in this area here. And I find this uh, video footage come uh, very belated because uh, this line is already claimed by the Russian side for a long, long time. So you know, for it to be only uh, reached established right now. Uh, yeah, feels a little bit uh, sus. And uh, over on the northern part, there was a Lancet attack on Ukrainian forces, confirming Ukrainian presence still in this area here. Essentially, the front line did not change. So in, in that sense. So um, we, we shall continue to monitor. Uh, I don't really like this situation where the Russian claims uh, precedes evidence by so much. So it, it might be like a preemptive... Uh, declaration of capture rather than actual capture so this is not good and uh so the russians are also trying to attack from the north but according to the information from the russian side it has not been successful so this is the situation at novo mihailivka uh we further up north uh at the boyeda region the russian forces are still trying to push out but it was not it doesn't seem very successful ukrainian forces counter attack and is in the southern outskirts of boyeda again so we will continue to monitor and see how this progress so you know all these cap this mention about captures are um, no quite sad you know if the, they declare victory and then after that the ukrainian recapture then it's kind of a embarrassment um for the up north uh Yogivka, uh the ukrainians basically based on the frontline change report uh, has acknowledged the Russian presence in this area here uh, in the southern part of Georgivka but that's about it no that is already claimed by the Russian side for some time so we'll continue to monitor the fighting at Krasnohorivka continues to be unknown it's still pretty much in the fog of war we do not know what is currently happening right there despite the reports fight of fighting at Krasnohorivka continues all the way uh, uh, non-stop from uh, both sides they are reporting this from the 27th of february where the first sudden attack broke through so uh, we shall continue to monitor and see how this progress we move on to the adfk front